Matt Lenehan, Boxing Social Association with Forge Irish Stout, Empire Fight Store, Freebets.com, Eddie Hearn, what a performance from Dalton Smith, mature, calculated, an ideal performance to show that he's ready to step up now. Yeah, world class. I mean, you know, the only step up from here is fighting for the world title. You know, I think we've got some great fights. I and mean, I was just saying, Regis Progray messaged me and said he loves the Dalton Smith fight. It's a tremendous fight. Um, we've got Paro, we've got the winner or loser of Taylor Cattrall. We've got Subriel Matias, we've got Devin Haney. Um, we've got uh, Liam Paro. I mean, the list is endless at 140. So, so many opportunities. But now with that, you know, WBC silver belt, he's put himself in a great position to chase that world championship now. With all the names you just mentioned, although Adam Azim's names we mentioned, surely the only way for him to go now is onto a fight, a Progre or a Matisse on them yeah, ones. Look, we, we'll take the Adam Azim fight every day of the week because although it's dropping back down the levels, we think we win the fight and it's a big money fight. And of course, we won that fight. But you know, I'm bored of talking about it already. And you know, I just feel like I don't know what they're doing or what they're playing at. But if you're not going to take the fight, move out of the way. And um, I don't think Azim's ready for that fight. He's a great fighter. But Dalton is a world-class fighter that could win a world championship now. Would you be able to do Azim at Hillsborough? Wherever. wherever. If they took it? We'd we'll do it at London. We'd we'll do it at wherever is he, his local arena. We'll do it on Sky. We'll do it in my back garden. I don't care. Yeah. Just give the guys the opportunity and make a great fight for British boxing. Dalton's mentioned he's obviously going to the um, show yeah. to support Florian. Yeah. And you said he was banned from the last one. Yeah, Explain they, no, they, they wouldn't give him tickets for the last one. Which is pretty weird and sad. But it's the world we live in. Are you surprised with how the, the fact they've left it this long without sort of pulling yes, the trigger? But they don't really know what they're doing. So what you do, when you don't know what you're doing, you don't do anything, right? What you need to do is you get the kid in the office, you talk as a team, and they've already established that they're not taking a fight. So what you do is you say, listen, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out there. Do you remember um, Batfink? Is it Batfink? My, my wings are a shield of steel. Is that right, Batfink? If you're all a bit, you're all a bit. Just, young. Go, just go with it. Who's yeah. a bit older in here? Mark, yeah. Batfink. My my wings are a shield of steel. That yeah. So what you are is you you're Batfink, right? So you go out and you say to your fighter, listen, you're not ready for this fight yet, and you're going to get a load of stick. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out and I'm going to be Batfink, because my wings are a shield of steel, and you take all the pelters, right? So all you lot. Right? I call you guys vultures. I love you all, but you are vultures at the same time. In a nice way. I mean, I've been called much worse than vulture, right? Well, don't look down your nose, right? But what I'm saying is, you go out and you protect your fighter. You say, I made the decision. He's not ready for this level. He's going to beat Dalton Smith when he's ready. But we're a couple of fights behind him. So good luck, Dalton Smith. We'll catch you later. Now what's happened is the whole of social media after that performance is at Adam Azim going, mate, you better not bottle out of this fight. Uh, and then he gets loads of stick. Ask Fraser Clark about the stick and criticism he got. It, like, it really affected him. Because you've got to go out and protect your fighter or in front of all you guys and defend your man. But now it's going to get really embarrassing. And they, listen, maybe they're just going to, they're, they're so like, snookered and embarrassed. Maybe they take the fight. I don't think so. I hope so. But I really don't think so. Let's come on to Sandy Ryan, Ishmael Davis, and obviously Campbell Hans, yeah. a quick run through. A terrific yeah. night of boxing. Oh, it was a brilliant night of boxing. You know, Sandy Ryan was fantastic. Um, you know, shout out to Terry Harper, of course. Ishmael Davis, great fight. Glad that fight went on. Nico Levi's great knockout. And listen, uh, fair play, Jimmy Joe Flynn. I thought Campbell Hatton was fantastic as well. I hope he gets the credit of giving everything. You know, you, you, if you give everything and you lose, you can look yourself in the mirror. And all we ever want to see is great fights, and Campbell Hatton gave us one of those tonight. He's always had a double-edged sword, hasn't he, because of his last name, but then tonight he's probably got more out yeah, of a defeat, hasn't he, than a win. He's tears in a change room, you know? And I said to him, mate, I promise you, you're going to get the respect to the public, respect to the people, because they couldn't do that. You know, they can't go in there and fucking get smashed around the ring and come back and piss in blood after the fight and, you know, out on your feet, can't breathe, and you keep digging in and you keep trading shots. It's a tough old game. And he showed he's got it. He's got it in there and he's got it in here. But you've got to be better. And tonight he came up against a better man. Uh, last one for me, Sandy Ryan with that devastating performance over Terry Harper. Um, you mentioned their best in the world at that weight. She's had a long time sort of back and forth a little bit with Chantel Cameron. If Katie Taylor's not fighting Chantel next, yeah, can we do that fight? I'd love to. You know, great fight. Chantel wants big fights, big paydays. Maybe that's one of them. You know, Natasha Jonas, great fighter, great name to fight, big unification. Can you make the Tasha fight? Yep, on Sky, on Design. I don't care. Just give, give Sandy Ryan the opportunity. Um, and also uh, Michaela Meyer. 
Yeah. Great fight. So I think Sandy's the best in the division. So we're, we're ready to prove it. Eddie, I appreciate your time. Cheers.